Hello dear students, in the class now, uh, even a paper and the PhD second year chemistry paper bugge analysis manona. So Nivel uh, Rigo last video nali nanu part B section as well as passing package bugge discuss madidwe. So you can I th I hope other tumba helpful agade. So without wasting the time, we will start now Ivaga part A section and analysis manana. So Modalane question part A section ali, which of the which kind of the defect is introduced by doping intrinsic semiconductors and the intrinsic semiconductors on a dope model of the course kara now adana ye nanta karitivi yao riti ata defect ananta karitivi so intrinsic semiconductor anna extrinsic semiconductor agi model of the k now electron rich or electron poor elements gana add model so if we add electron rich elements such as 15 group elements Bora, uh, 15 group elements like phosphorus, arsenic, antimony, bismuth, n type of semiconductor. If it is added with the poor elements like 13 group elements, boron, aluminium, gallium, indium, thallium, p type of semiconductor. So, totally it is an electronic defect. That is option B. Don't go with the what uh, dislocation defect, Scott key defect, or any other defect. Okay, it is purely electronic defect, either a rich or poor. Next, second question is a chapter solution. A binary liquid mixture that forms maximum boiling azeotrope at specific composition. So, azeotropes are the non-ideal solution, either of a positive deviation or a negative deviation. He is asking maximum boiling azeotrope, ne negative deviation. So, negative deviation from the Rolle's law. Non-ideal solution showing negative deviation from Rolle's law. Answer is... Uh, D that is nitric acid plus water nitric acid plus water HNO3 plus water next the next question is the value of Venta factor I for ethanoic acid in the benzene is nearly so this was solution chapter so solution chapter last part Venta factor Yavaga ethanoic acid benzene a protic solvent malage add martivi the ethanoic acid dimerizes undergoes association and Two molecules become one. One by two. Answer is 0 0.5. That is C. Next question number four. On charging lead storage battery, lead sulfate on cathode is converted into actually balanced confusing the balanced students discharging other theory. So the reverse end the charging. That is PbO2 is the answer. That lead sulfate changes into PbO2 at cathode. I can uh, discharging at cathode at PbO2 is the PbSO4 agatha. Other the reverse reaction, PbSO4 changes to PbO2. Andre, discharging at cathode was PbO2, changes into PbSO4. Charging at cathode, PbSO4 changes to PbO2. So, therefore, the answer is what? PbO2. Fifth question. In Arrhenius equation, the factor e to the power of minus Ea by Rt corresponds to uh, that is the option C, the fraction of molecules with kinetic energy greater than Ea. So, that is fraction of molecules which are possessing kinetic energy that is greater than activation energy is the value of the term of e to the power of minus Ea by Rt. That question number 6, which one of the following is not applicable to the phenomenon of adsorption? We know that adsorption is a natural phenomenon. It is a spontaneous process. So, therefore, Gibbs free energy will be negative. Gibbs free energy, when it will be negative? When delta G is negative, delta H is negative, and delta S is also negative. So, all must be negative. So, all must be negative, then only Gibbs free energy is negative. So, therefore, yeah, which is which phenomenon is not possible? That is, delta H is positive is not possible. So, therefore, the answer is which one? Delta H is positive. Okay. So, uh, remember, yalla kuda negative at the entropy, enthalpy and Gibbs free energy. So, idana new put maadadaga, delta G is equal to delta H minus T into delta S negative. This is negative, 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 positive. Delta H is more negative than delta S. So, therefore, all must be negative. Question number 7, that is metallurgy, that is general principles, processes for the isolation of elements. The question is, what is the role of NaCN in the separation of ZNS, lead uh, zinc sulfide and lead sulfide for the froth protection? It is a direct question. That is, sodium cyanide is behaves as an 
what depresents which depresses the zinc sulfide zinc sulfide sodium cyanide jothe react agi olagade drawn agutte water nalli and lead sulfide will come easily with the froth next eighth question on complete hydrolysis of xenon hexafluoride with water the product see xenon hexafluoride on reacting with three molecule of water see here prati oxygen valency 2 prati fluorine valency 1 three oxygen six fluorine anna displace displace maadi xco3 and six hf anna maadatta so therefore the answer is option b that is xco3 so three molecules of water completely hydrolyzes the xenon hexafluoride into xenon trioxide so 18 group element p block element ninth question which of the following is not regarded as a transition element so this was purely d and f block element unit so see here optionally iron is a scandium is a manganese is a iron scandium manganese they are having partially filled d orbitals so that's why they are transition elements but zinc is not complete transition element it is a pseudo transition element why it is a pseudo transition element because because it has 3d 10 electronic configuration it does not containing partially filled d orbital it contains 3d 10 fulfilled d orbital so that's why it is not in a transition element it is a pseudo transition element that is a direct question tenth question uh, coordination compound last bit in the name metal and carbon bond in the metal carbonyl possesses both sigma and pi bond due to synergic effect see here textbook nali the synergic effect so metal will form a coordination bond with the sigma bond back bonding is done by the what uh, anti bonding to pi star 2 px orbital of carbon monoxide carbon gives electron back to the what metal and forming a what pi bond that is it has two sigma and as well as what pi character that is strengthen they both gives strength to each other by back bonding so this is synergic effect that answer is both sigma and pi character identify the chiral molecule in the following compound option a is the answer that is two bromobutane i will give you the structure ch3 chbr single bond ch2 ch3 look at this second carbon second carbon is bonded with ch3 ethyl hydrogen br so therefore it is chiral carbon so therefore it is a chiral molecule next 12th question is very interesting question that is alcohol phenols ethers only ethers topic barest student remember me sodium and sodium methoxide reacts with tertiary butyl bromide it gives exclusively answer is what c 2 methyl propene yakandre reaction berithe nodri ch3o minus na plus is behaves as a strong base it reacts with tertiary butyl bromide andre idu williamson ether synthesis ago badlu enaitu dehydrohalogenation nan helidda the williamson ether synthesis is a sn2 mechanism ali now tertiary alkylalate thagobeku but illi thagondirudu avaru sorry ali thagobekagirudu primary alkylalate but ivaru thagondirudu tertiary so that's why it undergo dehydrobromination yakandre sodium methoxide strong base agi work maadi hb we will get nabr byproduct methanol byproduct and we will get 2 methyl propene that is answer is c okay c is the answer so iodoform reaction with sodium hypoiodide question number 13 chapter is aldehyde ketones and carboxylic acid sodium hypoiodide can be used for the detection of the compound in the option b answer yavudu acetaldehyde because acetaldehyde is containing alpha methylene group it is an iodoform reaction see acetaldehyde athava ethanol athra alpha methylene independent ch3 group ide adu sodium uh, hypoiodide jothege combine aagi iodoform anna kodutta yellow color precipitate anna kodutta chi3 yellow ppt it will give so because of that we can identify the what acetaldehyde by treating with the sodium hypoiodide by producing a yellow color it is an iodoform reaction remember because of presence of alpha methylene group it is giving a yellow color with acetaldehyde 
14th question nitration of aniline in strong acidic medium at 288 kelvin it is a direct nitration it will give a black color tarry mass of mixture of ortho meta and para nitro aniline so therefore option d is the answer direct agi nitration madidre some of the aniline uh, not only attacks to the ortho and para positions some of the aniline changes to anilinium ion try to understand some of the aniline on reacting with the nitric acid and sulfuric acid of nitrating mixture changes into anilinium ion they are meta directing group anilinium ion is a meta directing group so therefore we will get ortho and para and meta nitro aniline so answer is d 15th question which hormone is iodinated derivative of amino acid of tyrosine it is a twist madidane iodinated andre iodine containing hormone direct ag baribodu option c biomolecule in it that is thyroxine okay so i hope you all get the uh, what answers now so now i will move to the what fill in the blanks there because of low concentration of o2 in the blood uh, and the tissues of the people living uh, people living at high altitude suffer from the disease that is called as anoxia in high altitude the oxygen level is less so therefore the hemoglobin could not dissolve the oxygen so therefore suffocation will be taking place uh, because of lack of oxygen dissolution of oxygen in the blood so therefore that that condition is called as anoxia so inverse second question that is 17 question number that is inversion of cane sugar is an example of pseudo trans pseudo first order reaction where the rate of the reaction depends only on the configuration and uh, only on the concentration of uh, sucrose but not on the water because water concentration is higher next the 18 question redon is obtained as a decay product of radium and the radium uh, 226 its atomic number is radium atomic number is 88 mass is 226 after decaying it will produce as radon with triple two mass and 86 atomic number helium is having atomic number 2 and mass number is 4 so which which is getting radium is getting and last question that is dash is a synthetic progesterone derivative most widely used as an antifertility drug that progesterone derivative is norethindron which is used as an what uh, antifertility drug so i hope you all have attempted these all the answers and uh, wish you all the best and remember one more information in the Kalburgi Bhagadali Ruvanta Ella Vidyarthi Kalige Now Crash Course Nadis Thidvi Neat KCET Regular Classes Irathe 45 Days So Enroll Maadabeku Before Examination Athava Examination Aage Yerad Diusa Adar Olagi Maadidre Enrollment Aagatta We Can What You Will Get The Word Seats Otherwise You Won't Get So Please Enroll The Word Crash Course कल्बुर्गी भागदले रुवद्धा विध्यार्थी गड़ी गेड़ू देनंदरे क्राश कोर्स ना एंड्रोल माड़ी अल्फा टूटोरियल्स कल्बुर्गी